Light and view. It's so critical to having that connection to the outside. And then light is proven to improve someone's well-being and, and health status. I think that connection to the out of doors, even if we're not out in it, to have the light come in, it gives us that connection that I think really feeds our soul and makes us feel whole. When you have uh, the ability to create and sculpt environments that take advantage of light, you certainly want to do that. To do it, but to do it well and balanced is not always easy to achieve. The conversation starts out, what is your utopia? What's your dream day in the house? Who's there? What are you saying? What are you doing? And then we start to build the design around that, because that's ultimately what we're trying to do is design the experience. The clients are the inspiration here. He is from Sweden. She's from Minnesota. They wanted to create what they called sort of a modern Swedish cottage. From an aesthetic standpoint, it was something that was a blend, more transitional, not modern, not traditional, but there are certain elements of both of those that are incorporated into the design. Throughout, we were really working on how do we inject something fresh, but yet gave it a little bit of surprise and a little bit of tension. Tension could be a textural play with some really smooth, with really rough. It could be modern and traditional. We've got very modern art and we've got really traditional art. And to me, the exciting part is when those all come together. This room is one of my favorite rooms because it blends a lot of polar opposites that make it unified. And what I mean by that is it's very light, very bright, and it has volume to it. It's 24 feet tall at its peak, but you don't feel like you're in a gymnasium. It feels cozy and quaint. When you have a juxtaposition of contrasting elements, it also becomes so personal because not everyone's gonna like it, and that's okay. This isn't a house for everybody. This is a house for this family. One of the things that was really important for our client was to feel at one with nature. I don't like to overfill a space. And windows in particular, I'd like to give them breathing room to do what they do, which is be the connection to the outside. Windows are probably the most important product that we put into a house. There is an immediacy to getting up and seeing outside. So we start to talk about how do you access the outdoors visually and physically? And how does it play into your dream day? You can have certain people or members of the family inside of the home and others on the outside of the house in the yard or by the pool or barbecuing in an outdoor kitchen area. You can see each other and so then you are still attached to each other and you can communicate with each other. And that's solely due to the size of the window openings that Marvin allows us to create. Marvin Windows gives us the tools to create these wonderful spaces. It doesn't matter if the home is traditional or transitional like this one or other contemporary homes. They give us the tools to create beautiful spaces. Marvin is so adept at offering options and saying, you know, you dream it up and we'll come up with approaches to make that happen and make it a reality. I think it's that willingness to continue to innovate and explore and grow that is what continues to make Marvin an essential piece of a project team. Our team values Marvin's consistency of product and reliability of service and support. So if there's a new product that we're installing and something we haven't installed before, Marvin's great about getting the right people out there to help our guys learn it, how to install it properly. And that's been crucial as well to the success. At this level of project, it really is about what can we dream up, what can we cook up? And who's got the wherewithal to deliver on that? And Marvin's got that wherewithal in spades.